Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for joining. Really appreciate it. Uh, doing this video because I was teaching a fitness class recently, and we were doing a plank, a plank, where you have your hands out, legs out straight behind you, and you're holding your body weight, just your body weight. And as soon as it got hard, the knees started to hit the floor. And I just want to tell you that when something becomes hard or challenging, that's not the time to stop. That's not when you stop. That's when you go a little deeper, connect to that sensation, and ask yourself, what would happen if I stayed in it five more seconds? What would happen if I stuck around for another second even? But as soon as it gets hard, don't let your knees just drop to the floor. Come down to your elbows, do something. Fight for yourself, fight for your health, fight for your muscle, your bone density. Because who's gonna do it for you? Who's gonna do it for you? When these things get hard, you have to just do it, all right? So, there can be a lot of fancy programs, a lot of fancy diets. I know right now it's keto and carnivore and all these kind of things. That's all fine and dandy. I don't care which one you do. Are you gonna stick to it? That's the question. I don't care which workout you do either. I don't care if you're crossfitting or if you're knitting. Are you gonna stick to it is the question. Can you stick to it? Or are you gonna stop when it gets hard and go find something else to do, right? So when the exercise gets hard or when anything gets hard for you, quitting should not be one of your methods. What would happen if you went just a little bit further? That's where training comes in. Now you're training your mind and your body together. When it gets hard, don't just flee. Hang in there and see what happens. Hope this has been informative. Have a nice day.